approved. Does that mean I've got that in the inventory? Okay, different tabs for different things. That's okay. Cool. Talk to seems to point this way so we will head this way points there so I don't know why he's telling me that though you couldn't place it the man's tattoo looked incredibly familiar Either you had seen it before, or it was the most powerful case of deja vu that had ever struck you. The more you thought about it, the more your head screamed in protest. An image exploded into your mind. You recalled a man with obsidian hair giving you a uniform. A symbol embroidered on the shoulder mirrored the design of the sword hanging from his belt. Both the sword and embroidery perfectly match the tattoo you just found on the dead man. You remembered feeling proud to wear that uniform. Proud to truly be a part of something. Your headache flashed again, and the memory faded. You realized you'd never worn a uniform like that. What was going on? Don't ask me, I'm totally confused. <clears throat> so what have we got to do now? Report to Murtas. Big city, isn't it? For early on in the game, and all done well. What the hell? Help the oh, help the unfinished house again. What is this it? Press numlock to automatically run forward without holding down W. Is it? Is it this one? Oh no, it's that one over there. God, Nick, you're blind sometimes. It's got to be that one there, hasn't it? Another one here. Oh, 
Well, thankfully, doing the uh, the other side gave me an insight into that, didn't it? I know what some of these are. It's a sword. Right click an item in your bag to automatically. There's a staff, I need that. Log icon in the lower right or press L to view quest details. Activate quest items by right clicking their icons in the quest tracker. Can't be used there. So, where can it be used? Wouldn't be in the field here, would it, by any chance? icon in the lower right or press L to view quest details. Activate quest items by right-clicking their icons in the quest tracker. Right-click an item in your bag to automatically equip it on your character. You recognized the name? Shadowhawks, as belonging to an infamous group of criminals. The organization was so powerful, many members didn't bother working undercover. They even wore uniforms, flaunting their crimes. But you also recognized the name Shadowhawk for other reasons. Your head pounded as more unfamiliar memories flashed in your vision. The memory centered around the dead man's tattoo. You saw it forged into a dagger handle. You felt yourself sliding the dagger between someone's ribs. Nice. Were you going crazy? Okay. Abilities in the skills window. Click the skills icon in the menu bar or press K to open it. Open skills, a new. Skill set now. Which way would I go here? Would I go? Would I go into sorcery? I would do shadow play to go with this. No, that's more of the uh, assassin rogue style, isn't it? I'd definitely go for the sorcery, I think.
Okay. So now we've got the fireball. And occultism. Right. Hello, Yuli. Oh, a lot of this is local stuff in this area. What's that? Handicraft kiln. Still need some works bench. I mean, I'm wondering where you're going to get the items for the uh, the leather working and such. Is there animals to kill that you skin or? Slightly curious about that, I must admit. Alright, well, that's all the way up there and this is just here, so we'll do this one. What is this? Collect food and axe from giant ant and baby ant. Ooh, big ants, very big ants. Okay, that was easy enough. Well, I'll get him away. Oh, we're heading over here now. So, um, I wonder... Uh, have we picked up any crafting materials? Just the flowers that we harvested before. for that. Process from pelts. So I wonder where we get the pelts from. Oh, there's a quest there. 
It's a good line of sight in this game, don't you think? Good distance, draw distance. From what I've seen so far, quite impressed. Although you don't see anything that's new. I think the only thing I've seen that's new so far is climbing a tree. Where everything is done nicely, there's nothing to complain about really. Pick up the propeller. Really? Take it, this is the road that I'm on. What's that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ouch. Right. <laughs> Different. Tattooist. Your people had never shied from risk, if it meant great reward. Centuries ago, an expedition tried to find the birthplace of the world, the source of all magic. Somehow, they had succeeded and had altered the fate of the world. They'd inherited fantastic powers. Powers that destroyed the continent of Auroria, but also saved the people living there. Transporting them to new, safer lands. When any of the adventurers died, their new powers passed their memories to all Auroria survivors. Transferred by blood through generations, most of those memories had begun to fade. But it was said that in some gifted people, they could re-emerge. It could be happening to you. Why is it people with mounts and I don't have one? I'm upset. Right. Stumped from spotted ostriches and kill giant mantis. Okay. What 
Dako. Crippley Meyer upgraded. Okay. What am I supposed to do with this? Spotted ostriches. What's this bit here? Is this for where I let the firecracker off? Some quests will give you a free mount to raise. Mount quest. Where's the mount quest? Getting slightly sidetracked again, but here we go. No oh, shadow hawks, here we go. Some of the names of the twelve adventurers, the library expedition, were well known. Everyone had heard of Jean, who'd been transformed into Curios. The god of destruction. However, the memories that most often surfaced in Harani belonged to an assassin named Melisara. You hearkened back to the first memory you'd experienced. Through Melisara's eyes, you saw the dark haired man hand her the uniform. Then offer a boyish grin and say, Welcome to the Shadow Hawks. She glared at him, but forced a smile. It was Jean. Okay, well, let's head back into town and do that. And I think we will call it there for this episode. A mount helps you move faster. They can be purchased in shops or received as quest rewards. Apparently, the heritage of the Shadowhawks went back further than most Harani realized. You studied a map marked with Haman's meeting place and saw a ghostly image of another map. Another memory. As your head ached, you looked out through Melisara's eyes. You saw an elegant queen with cold eyes point at the map. He's here, in Delphinad, the queen snarled. If I can't take my pound of flesh from the mother, I'll take it from the son, Melisara said. Make your peace, Jean Evernight. The hereafter is waiting. Alright, picking up plenty of quests, but we'll call it there for this episode. Don't forget guys, if you like the videos please leave me a like and subscribe if you already haven't. Uh, I'll try and do a bit more of this um, Arcage Stage 3 beta. Maybe tomorrow, tomorrow's the last day I think. So keep your eyes open for some more. It might on be on all grey, or it might be an all grey. I've not decided yet. I will see you very soon. This is all grey signing off.